Are you kidding me? This can't be true. Could it? Top of the morning to you. So God's word is full of amazing claims and statements and possibilities and realities that if we truly believed, we'd be ecstatic, encouraged, full of hope, joy, love, peace, patience, kindness, gentleness, and self-control just oozing out of us. Instead, many around us today are exact opposite, including Christians. We read God's word, but see it as a pie-in-the-sky type of world, only available in heaven after we die. As a result, we're full of depression, anger, anxiety, impatience, harshness, manipulation, all because we don't trust that God's word is for today and not for us personally. In Ephesians 3, Paul gives us a portrait of what it is possible verse 16 through 20 in the Passion Translation. Listen to this. That God would unveil within you the unlimited riches of His glory and favor with supernatural strength, flooding your innermost being with God's divine might and explosive power. Do you have that explosive power? I want it. Verse 17. Then by constantly using your faith, to the life of Christ will be released deep inside you. The resting place of his love will become the very source and root of your life. Is that the source and root of your life and my life? God's love? Verse 18 through 19. Then you will be empowered to discover what every Holy One experiences. Here it is. The great magnitude of his astonishing love of Christ in all its dimensions. How deeply intimate and far-reaching is his love. How enduring and inclusive it is. Endless love beyond measure that transcends our understanding. This extravagant love pours into you until you are filled to overflowing with the fullness of God. Are we filled with the overflowing fullness of God? Verse 20, never doubt God's mighty power to work in you and accomplish all this. He will achieve infinitely more than your greatest request, your most unbelievable dream, and exceed your wildest imagination. He will outdo them all, for his miraculous power constantly energizes us. Wow. Lord, just give me a little of that revelation and make it real, and I'd be jumping all over the place with excitement. Are we living like we have an unlimited supply of God's love and power available to us today? Take a look at how you feel and think about, think most of the time. Does it reflect what God says he will make available today? God's word is truth. Let's all act like it. Have a great day.